children today we are going into a new lesson attraction and repulsion from the name of the lesson itself we can understand that it is something connected to attraction isn't it so in science when it comes to attraction what does it mean for that we will do a small activity okay i have got a bowl of water and a fish is flowing in it okay a fish is flowing in the water you can see now i want to catch this fish okay this is a paper fish so i am going to catch this fish i am going to give food to the fish and i am going to catch this fish with this string so i am going to give the food so when the food came near the fish okay this fish caught the bait what i gave so this is a paper fish how did this fish catch this is it having a mouth no you can see isn't it so how did this catch the bait which i gave it very simple you would have understood isn't it what is this actually this is a magnet okay and it's only a paper fish when you look like this but what i have done here what i have what have i done i have kept a pin inside and i stuck both the papers together so that you would not see so when i brought this closer the magnet got attracted to the pin okay so i hope you have understood this so this is just a game what we did now in your textbook there were two children neenu so in neenu's house the door was going on banging on the wall because of the wind so what did neenu do he and his brother decided to do something so that the board the door will not bang so they did something on the wall and they got the result the door was not banging so what are the things they stuck onto the door and the wall so that it does not uh, come and bang on the wall four sets of things are given here you can see here four sets of things are given where what are they set 1 wooden block and gum set 2 wooden block means a piece of wood set 2 magnet and an iron piece set 3 two magnets set 4 bricks so from this which are the things that neenu and her brother used can you guess and tell me yes all your guess is right isn't it what did they use there a magnet and an iron piece so we know the magnet will get attracted to the iron piece so if you keep a magnet on the door and an iron piece fixed on the wall if you keep the door close to it it will go and stick on to it and it will not bang again so that is the trick they used there now have you seen magnets yes isn't it now this is a magnet which i have in my hand this is called as a bar magnet now here teacher is going to give you an activity in the textbook there are few things which are given there isn't it what are the things given there you have to take out your science kit or the lab at home kit which you have prepared at home and kept have you got it there so take it out and what have we to do i have asked you to collect certain things and keep in that isn't it from that you have to take out coins then uh, if you have a compass in your uh, instrument box you can take out that also a spoon then a pen a rubber a glass piece if you have then gem clips you know what are gem clips what we put for the paper together gem clips any other plastic things so collect as many you might not have all these things inside your science kit but whatever things you have in your home collect it together 
keep it on a table and what are we to do you have got a magnet with you isn't it in your science kit you have got a magnet so take out that magnet and what are we to do keep that magnet closed to all the things bring these things one by one bring it closer see which are the things which are getting attracted to the magnet and which are the things which are not getting attracted to the magnet and you have a table here in the textbook what are we to do you have to complete this table teacher is not going to do this activity here so what are we to do take and keep these things on the table bring each thing close to the magnet find out which are getting attracted which are not getting attracted and complete the table and what will be this is an experiment you are doing so write it in an experiment format and take your photo mm -hmm. of how you are doing and send it to me from this what conclusion are you going to draw substances that or things or objects which get attracted to magnet are called as magnetic substances so for example i have this pin in my hand isn't it so this is a pin now this pin is getting attracted to this magnet this is a small magnet so this pin is getting attracted to the magnet so what is a pin a pin is a magnetic substance okay so when you bring a pin or uh, anything close to the magnet if it is attracting to the magnet such a substance is called as or an object is called as a magnetic substance and the ones which are not getting attracted to the magnet are called as non magnetic substances okay non magnetic substances so which are magnetic substances things which are attracted by the magnet are called magnetic substances and things which are not attracted by the magnet are called as non magnetic substances so this is the work you have to do today please do it take your photo write the experiment in a nice neat paper and send it to me and you have to file and keep this experiment with you thank you children